Hello guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily add stickers to your 3D model in Blender using a second UV map. And this is how we are going to do it. I have this vehicle's 3D model imported from the transportation add-on. You can go straight into the shader editor and select the model. And let's just space this out. So we want to add another mix shader. I'll create a second mix shader. Link that to the first one. So then we can go ahead and drag in the sticker that we want to add. And we're using a PNG image of this call on fire. So with our image imported, we can link that to a principal BSDF. And we want to mix that with a transparent BSDF. So then we are going to add a mapping. So here with our vehicle selected, we go to our data and UV maps. We want to add a second UV map. Press here to add the second UV map. And we'll make it active by selecting this camera icon. So let's go into UV editing. Go into your face select mode. And here you can see this is the first UV map. And for the second UV map, what we want to do is select the area we want to project. We want to project it on this door. UV, project from view. Select that and scale that up. And then you go here, select, invert your selection. And we want to move every other thing out of the scene. So if you see this, the original UV map, the first one, this is the second one that we're working on. And we have the door isolated. So let's go back to our layout. To so our mapping node, we want to add a UV. Add the UV map, link that up to the vector, and specify the second UV map. And here where we have repeat, we want to change that to clip. You can see the model is looking a bit transparent. We can solve that by taking the alpha and put that into the factor. And then we want to invert the alpha by adding invert color. And then take the inverted color, also add it to the second mix shader. So now the good thing about this is that we still have the principal DSDF, so we can change the values of the material's texture. You can play with the roughness, increase the metallic. And if you go to your UV and select the door, you can move the UV map and place it where we want. So if you want to add a third UV map, you just follow the same process. Come back here, add another mix shader. It can get a bit messy, so just make sure you arrange your nodes well. Shift A, you add another mix shader. Link that up. Want a principal BSDF for a third shader and a transparent. This is the image that I want to use for the second sticker. Place the image to the base color. Add another mapping. Create a new UV map. Go to our UV editing. So let's make sure the new UV map is active. So you can see the first, the second. This is the one we just created. I want to move all this away. Since we want to project it on this side of the vehicle, we we'll select this area. And then the UV project from view and take that and scale it up. Let's go back to our layout and add UV map and specify second UV map. From here, repeat and change that to click. We have it projected at the other side. We are still having the same transparency issue. So we'll come here to the alpha, link that up like we did the other one to the factor, add Invert color to the alpha and then take that inverted color and put it in the mix shader. So using the same texture, we can just select another part of this vehicle. We can use the same UV map, the second one, UV, project from view, take the UV map. 
arrange it where we want it here we can rotate that and scale it down to form a design on top of the vehicle so there you have it this is an easy way to add textures to your vehicle in blender i hope you found this helpful don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video